Hey, Mr. Clash here with another base breakdown and two three-star attack replays. A similar base, not the identical base. Now what we've got here is a windmill type base, spiral base, pinwheel sort of a base. Okay, now the read on this base is large bomb here in this. <laughs> How about I make that a smaller dot? Uh, is a large bomb in there, large bomb next to the Tesla. Uh, yep. Oh, next to the expo Tesla between the wizard and each um, elixir bowl and then the other two big bombs anybody's guess could be one here could be one here and could be one here now the plan is on this one I will come in at the bottom like this this expo has a range that may trigger the golem now seeing as there's a Tesla here and I want to break the wall at this uh, wizard the, I, the plan is to send the third golem in at this wizard that will trigger the Tesla Then I can send the wall breakers in these wizards uh, these golems on the side go first That way they'll take the fire from the wizard and that way the wall breaker won't suffer any splash damage from the wizard That's the reason to distract the wizard um, If I couldn't do that then I would have sent a hog in to distract the wizard and then I could wall break the wall unimpeded Get a jump spell down now where the queen jumps to in here is anybody's guess so a generic jump spell in there somewhere ideally i'd want it over here it doesn't matter now with the wizard deployment the wizard should be able to take out these two weapons pretty well and maybe this one as well and then the queen should be able to take this out because when the queen paths in she should be able to take out all of these things so that's just going to leave hogs for me now Seeing as this could be a bomb location, I want to send some hogs in from this low, this direction so that when they hit the cannon, they'll path to that. They're not going to really trigger that. Bomb's not going to do too much damage to them if it gets triggered because they're going to be a little bit further away from it. And then send some hogs in on these weapons on here and just come around with them like that. Now, as I believe, this is a um, big bomb there at the location. Bit of a Tesla. I'm going to try and drop the heel so it covers everything. So it covers a little bit of the Tesla thing and covers that bomb as well. Now the other bombs will be uh, around here. I believe there's a bomb there. So I'll be having a heal spell for here. And wherever else I feel is a heal spell needed is probably going to be around here somewhere. If the golems are still up, great. Maybe this expo will retarget. Maybe the king's here. So I'm going to need a heal for these areas around here. And then they'll path around here under heal and then take out these last two weapons. So the hogs will come in from here, end up pathing around. Queen and King should get in the core, take this out. And if not, the hogs will take this out and path around. That's the general plan of attack on this base. Now let's uh, clear this off. And I want to address the elephant in the room first. I have a level 30 queen. That's the elephant in the room. And this is not a max base. As you can see, these weapons here, 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 here. These are not max weapons for Town Hall 9 at all. And the heroes is low level. However, that doesn't mean the plan doesn't work if you're a low level hero. And that's what I'm going to show you in the second attack. That it's the same plan, overall plan. Because the difference of the core is a little bit different than the attack entry point is a fraction different. However, it is still the same overall plan. Anyway, let's just clear that off now. And we'll have a look at uh, how that plan went in action okay just waiting for the troops to go down now and you'll see that when the drop of the third golem is so I've doubled up the wizards on each side now that third golem's passed over to the cannon now if you have a look closely at where the CC was dropped it should have passed to the wizard and once the first wall breaker went it triggered the Tesla Remember the Tesla's shooting range is different to its triggering range. Its triggering range is shorter and then its shooting range is longer. So it took the wall breaker to trigger, but then it zeroed in on the gobl on the golem. So everything's gone in according to plan. Double poison for the CC. I didn't think I'd need the poison for the hogs. I normally like to keep a poison for the hogs, but a, a double dra dragon and double balloons, I thought I'll slow them right down. I'll, I'll take them all out. Hogs have gone in. Three to four per defense on that side. Heal spell covers the Tesla, Mortar, and the Expo area, plus where that bomb is. So the hogs are fine under the bomb. Last remaining hogs coming in. Two more up the sleeve. They go on in that top Archer Tower. And just the surgical deployment of the hogs will just take everything out. Too much distraction. 
heal spell in that area where the wizard is and the cannon shooting on them. One more heal spell where the next likely bomb is, is what I figured. And yep, there we go. The bomb was real. So it was a good read on the base. And where was the other bomb? I don't know. It was most probably in that bottom compartment because nothing really pathed into that bottom compartment over the gap. So uh, I figure the hogs would have triggered the bomb over at that left-hand side cannon if there was one there. And you see the little golems just triggered a small bomb in that gap, but where the big bomb actually was, I don't really know. Those cleanup wizards went in, two at the bottom, one at the very bottom, one on the side, and now they've pathed around accordingly. I've still got wizards in the middle. So those are the part of the kill squad wizards that went in with the queen. They are still alive, just shooting. Everything's just shooting at walls now. So yeah, that's what the queen does. That's what the queen does. She shoots at walls. So even, it doesn't matter. She's level 30. She shoots at walls. <laughs> you can send her to logic school all you like and it doesn't make any difference. She shoots at walls. Okay. So that was how that one went. Now on this next base, you'll see that the queen is over on the right hand side of the base, not at the bottom. So come in on the right hand side of the base, same deployment style. One golem on each corner to distract the wizard. Once the wizard's distracted, send in a test wall breaker. Just wait for it. Wait for it. There it goes. Test wall breaker comes in. And now the second wall breaker comes in. And now the third golem. Now the king, queen, and two more wizards can go in. So that's six of the eight wizards deployed. Always keeping two wizards up your sleeve for cleanup. Got the jump spell down over that Tesla area. The queen has jumped over into the area box. So the king can go... Well, the king has taken the queen out, but no, the king... I don't think... No, I didn't raise the king. Okay, forgot to raise the king on this one. Send the hogs in. Surgical again. Three to four on those weapons. There is a big bomb in that outside compartment. So here where they're going to need it, just after the big bomb. Like I said in previous videos, you don't need to heal them right on the bomb. If they've got enough health and the bomb triggers and they can get through that area, they can go through a bomb area and then into a heal. So if you're a little bit concerned that if you bomb, if you heal right on a bomb, it might be detrimental for your hogs a little bit later, you can leave the heal a little bit. Not too much, but just a little bit. And is there a bomb at that top one? No bomb at that top one, just some spring, just some spring traps. And that's it. Now drop a wizard at the bottom and one more cleanup wizard. Where's it going to go? Should It should probably go on the side, I'd imagine, when it gets dropped. Just waiting for it to be dropped now. There we go. Just on the side so clean up wizard at the bottom clean up wizard at the side and the hogs at the top right hand side queen still alive in the middle enemy king still alive bashing on a golem at the queen <laughs> the queen should really target onto that king seeing as one of her troops is right there but it doesn't matter and there she goes she's tugging onto that king now with the help of a hog so the enemy king's gone down and that's it the base is pretty well finished so uh just remember like with in this instance the teslas were in slightly different arrangements one was between the uh, wizard and elixir and the other one is after the elixir they've swapped the elixir thing around now in that case where you want to come in where a wizard is you need to do something to divert the wizard so the wizard's not going to give splash damage to where your wall breakers were so if you can get a golem close by like in this case the wizard targeted a golem otherwise send in a hog onto the wizard to distract the wizard and get your wall breakers in that way Anyway, that's how to beat this spiral, pinwheel, windmill type base. I hope you found something useful in it. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next video.